Golden Panda's Double Heart Chinese Calligraphy Set gives you everything you need to get started in sumi painting, traditional sumi painting. And there is uh, a process to sumi painting. There are different steps, but let me just show you what comes in the set. You're going to get four traditional Chinese sumi style brushes. These are not going to act like a normal, if you're used to like a watercolor brush or, or oil or acrylic brush, the bristles aren't designed to bounce back the way you would think of like a sable hair. Uh, these hairs, goat, pony, uh, various hairs, keep their shape and that's part of the process. You also get, uh, we have a little uh, brush holder here, so you know if you just wanted to keep your, your brushes up in, in position. And you also get with the set a, a paperweight. So if you're working with rice paper, and just because we're demonstrating today quickly, I'm just using traditional watercolor paper, uh, this is a paperweight to keep things like your rice paper down uh, from buckling on you. Now, when you do sumi paintings, you um, can buy pre-mixed ink or uh, ink cakes, but a lot of times you grind your own ink. So you have a grinding stone here and a pigment stick. And I've already pre-filled this with water. Um, you have this very adorable little spoon here. Because you want to slowly add water as you go. Now, as you grind as you grind the pigment stick, some people, you know, I, I, I've mostly seen a, a lot of YouTubers that, that do Sumi talk about the process of grinding the ink, like I'm doing here, as, as part of the way that you get into, it, it's like a meditational thing, you, you're getting yourself into that, I don't know, that zone, that natural zone where you've kind of meditated and they actually recommend you go ahead and you grind for a good 20 minutes, you know, to get not only your ink nice, rich and black, but also get in the mindset of doing sumi work. But um, so we don't keep this video 20 minutes, I'm going to just grind a little bit. So you grind up that ink, and, and again, I, I, I could have, you know, ground for a long time, but you just, you just get to get that traditional sumi feel from the, from the ink on the grinding stone to on the page of the paper. A really, uh, really nice experience. As you can see, this is a very traditional form. This is actually made from soot. There's no shellac in this ink. It's going to dry to a really nice matte finish. And if I continue to grind, you would also see that um, you can get extremely black inks. Now, uh, there are two last things that I want to show you that come in this set. That would be these two soapstones. Now these are soapstone chops. And what these are are to do a traditional sumi signature. And soapstone is extremely soft. If I, if I worked my fingernail enough, I could probably carve it, but I wouldn't recommend it. You can get little tiny chiseling tools, make your own patterns or have them done custom uh, online. And then you also get this oil-based traditional um, red ink that you see a lot in Sumi work. And this is an oil-based thing. Now I brought from home, I actually had one of these made as a gift, just to kind of give you an idea of how it's used. You put your stamp into that ink, and then when you're done with your art, um, we'll just call this done with my art, it's a way to, to sign it. Now, <laughs> if this was on actual uh, rice paper, the impression would probably be more impressive, but we will go ahead and give that one more go. There you go. You kind of see there. So the Golden Panda Double Heart Chinese Calligraphy Set gives you everything you need to get started in doing your own sumi paintings today.